Now, there are only three guarantees in life. Death, taxes, and the Dallas Cowboys being bounced from the postseason. The Dallas Cowboys fielded one of the most talented teams in the NFL this season, and that led to Dallas being dumped out of the playoffs wildcard weekend at the hands of the San Francisco 49ers. This led to the Cowboys owner, Jerry Jones, saying that he was sick over the loss. Cowboys fans didn't feel much better. And that makes you wonder how much longer the fans, Jones, coaches, and Dallas players are going to accept mediocre finishes every season. The sad part is, this isn't unique to this current Dallas team. Since the Cowboys won their Super Bowls in the mid-90s, it's been one disappointment after another. Fielding players like Tony Romo, Terrell Owens, Jason Witten, Dak Prescott, Amari Cooper, Michael Gallup, Michael Parsons, and many others, you should have at least a championship appearance. However, here we are. And I'm not sure how the Dallas Cowboys fix this, and really, if they can. Now, Matthew Lennox of Cowboys Wire wrote, quote, Another season has gone by, and yet again, the Dallas Cowboys have squandered what seemed like a great opportunity to make a serious run at a sixth Super Bowl title. It's been a common theme for them over the last decade and a half. The Cowboys have had some very talented teams over that span, posting at at least 10 wins in 2007, 2009, 14, 16, 18, and 2020, and 2021. Unfortunately, they have also produced a total of three playoff wins during that time. As frustrating as it's been for fans, it needs to be even more so for the players. Not to say that it isn't, but at some point, the page has to turn and the team has to find success in the playoffs. For me, the biggest concern is how do they find that success? Where are things going wrong? They've changed coaches. They've changed quarterbacks. They've changed personnel. How do the Cowboys fix things? And that's a question that could be unanswerable. Perhaps, hot take. Perhaps it's moving on from Mike McCarthy in 2023 and perhaps signing Sean Payton to try to take the Cowboys to the next level. Now, NFL.com wrote this the day that the Cowboys were bounced from the playoffs, and I'm sharing this because I think it really highlights just how bad Jerry Jones feels at this time. The Dallas Cowboys fell 23-17 to at home to the San Francisco 49ers Sunday in the NFC wildcard round. Extraordinarily disappointed, very disappointed, disappointed for our fans, Jones told reporters after the game via the Dallas Morning News, Michael Galekin. This is quite a letdown. They outplayed us. Now, with a star-studded offense led by Prescott, Amari Cooper, CeeDee Lamb, and Ezekiel Elliott, and a defense highlighted by a presumptuous by a presumptive AP NFL Defensive Rookie of the Year, Micah Parsons, losing a first-round home game is hard to swallow in Dallas. Quote, when you get this combinations of players together, you need to have success. We all know how it goes in the NFL, Jones said. The whole thing is set up to take away from the best and add to the ones that really need improvement. And personnel-wise, I think we have one of the best. Now, unfortunately for the Cowboys, they're not going to be as strong next year as they were this year. And it feels like, again, they squandered another opportunity. And I wish I could say, hey, Cowboy fans, here's how they're going to fix it. But I really just don't know.